sketchbooks. Gosh dang it. Oh. I just wanted to say how much we love and appreciate you. Love you, Dad. Love you, son. So first off, happy Father's Day. Aw, uh, thank you. So today we brought in some dads to do a special challenge. Uh-oh. I'm scared. So we did something similar for Mother's Day. But for today's episode, you will be participating in a try not to cry challenge. Oh, oh no. So in honor of Father's Day, all of these videos are going to be based around dads. Okay. I love being a dad a hundred times more than I thought I would. I have three kids. It's been very rewarding. I've, I've loved every minute of it. I'm already crying. Oh my God. <laughs> so after each video that we show you, whether it made you cry or not, we're gonna have you rate it on a scale from one to five based on how emotional you thought they were. Five being high, cool. Let's get it. We asked 10 fathers and their children to participate in the short video. That's all they were told. Dad, what about me makes you proud? Oh, oh man. Um... Dad, what about me makes you proud? Oh man, Dad. I can feel it. Dad. But me makes you proud. So cute. You're loving. You're funny. I could go on and on. <laughs> what makes me proud about you is you just being yourself. I had trouble with alcohol. Gosh dang it. I had trouble with alcohol. It was actually an intervention. Even with all the other people there, you were the, the real reason that I made the decision to go into the treatment center that I did. And, uh, it's emotional. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. It's so You're difficult because I could put myself in the father yeah. aspect or I could put myself yeah. in the child Your aspect. Attention. If you're not around, like, that would be awful. <laughs> but, like, you're the, you're the person that would always laugh. Dad, I'm grateful because we didn't know how long you were going to be with us, so we're so happy. It's not very often you get a moment to express Dad. this. Dad. I'm proud of you for knowing that the most important thing was to just give your kids so much time. Oh, I'm that's... By you. Wow. I miss having the chance to just check in with you. Oh. I miss your sketchbooks. Gosh dang it. I miss your sketchbooks. I love you. I love you too. We don't say it enough. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. no. Hey. A lot of people don't have their dad. <laughs> it doesn't compute until they're gone. Oh, I hate this. <laughs> but yet I like so it. Tell them now. <laughs> Freak, man. <laughs> that one where she was talking to her dad who had passed. Oh my gosh. Whew. That's heavy stuff. Heavy stuff. Man. Cause I miss my dad. Standing there with my dad, I would have lost it. Standing there with my son or or my kids, I would have lost it. It's terrible. Ooh. So on a scale from one to five, <laughs> where are you gonna place that one? I would put it at a four. Probably a four. I'll give it a five. I can relate to that video. Four. Five. I'm tearing up right now. I probably give it a three. If y'all would have had like my kids in here with me and they were second out, I think I probably would cry. It's a five. I'm gonna go four. I feel like there's gonna be another one that completely destroys me. I'm Sam, the father of this beautiful woman. Oh God. The father of this beautiful woman. Oh, I do not want. 26 and a half years ago, Amy was born. So I knew that something I have a daughter. Was happen. When, I didn't know, but it was gonna happen. I dread this so day. I knew that something like this was gonna happen. When, I didn't know, but it was gonna happen at some point. So all that time, I had that time to prepare for it. He's seeing his, his, he's seeing his daughter off getting married and stuff, like passing you off to this man, you know, take care of my daughter, man, take care of her. Nothing can prepare a father for the day that he stands here as the father of the bride. Excuse me. You guys are monsters. Oh my gosh. When I first held you, I was, I was filled with, amongst other things, terror. How could I look after this little person? From that day on, my life changed. I was your dad. Amy has, in so many ways, made my life complete. You're everything, Amy. A dad could wish for. I think I would cry. I think I would definitely cry. And it is with an emotional heart 
a heart filled with love and pride that you can't imagine unless you've been in this position yourself. Okay. I hand over the mantle to this man, Scott. It's so scary. <laughs> I'm sure oh. I hand over the mantle to this man. It's like I've been taking care of this girl my whole life. Daughter, say, Watching her. It's your turn. And I would like to wish them all the love, happiness, luck, prosperity, everything for their future together. I wouldn't be able to get through that. There's no way. Stand and raise your glasses to this fantastic couple, Avian Okay. All right, it's getting there. Ooh, I'm trying to hold off on that one. It's uh, touching, and you can't describe the moment until until you're put in that situation. Have you ever thought about what it's going to be like when you and your kids one day get married? <sighs> I know it to be emotion. Yeah, he's in great videos, you know. He just thinks like, you know, when my daughter gets married, it's gonna be like, whoa. That's a five. That's coming from the heart. Five, Jesus. Four. It's a five for me. That one hits me hard. Three. It's touching, but it's something, you know, that you can get through it. Three. Three. I probably can't relate to that one as much, so um, maybe that's why I'm not gonna get as emotional. Will was doing just fine until you showed up. Look, we're still gonna take the trip. Oh, bull! Who doesn't know this scene? I think it's the Fresh Will Prince of Bel Air. Now, you gonna tell Will or not? I'm not gonna do your dirty work for you. I remember this episode. Uh, I'll call him from the road. Yeah, then why don't you do that? Yeah, I'll do that. Daddy out! Let me get a couple more of these. Will, <laughs> I'm glad you're here. Um, some business came up I gotta handle. So we're gonna have to put a, our trip on hold. You understand? Yeah, yeah, yeah that's, that's cool. Dude, this is like the scene where Will Smith like graduated to Longer. Yeah, freaking well, rock star. It was great seeing you, son. You too. Lou? Lou? He called him Lou, like you ain't my dad. You ain't never here, man. Yeah. Um... That's piercing. I'm sorry, Will. <laughs> you know what? Actually, this works out better for me. You know, the Slimmies of Summer come to class wearing next to nothing. You know what I'm Will, saying? Will, it's all right. He trying to play. He trying to play it off like he ain't, he ain't emotional. Mad. I'm saying at least he said goodbye this time. Do you know how many I kids I, I work with my money that have been through this? Present. I just wish I hadn't wasted my money buying this stupid present. I'm, I'm sorry. I, you know, if there was. Something that I Hey, you know do. what? You ain't got to do no, nothing, Uncle Phil. Hey, you know, ain't like I'm still five years old, you know? Ain't like I'm going to be sitting up every night asking my mom, when's daddy coming home, you know? Who oh needs him? Oh, my gosh. Hey, he wasn't there to teach me how to shoot my first basket, uh, but I learned. I learned, it, no? Hey, I got pretty damn good at it, too, didn't I, yeah. Uncle Phil? Yeah. Got through my first day without him, right? Mm. I learned how to drive. I learned how to shave. I learned how to fight without him. I had 14 great birthdays without him. He never even sent me a damn card. Die out with him! Oh. I had 14 great birthdays without him. He never even sent me a damn card. Die out with him! Uh. I'm gonna get a great job without him. I'm gonna marry me a beautiful honey, and I'm having me a whole bunch of kids. I'm gonna be a better father than he ever was. And I sure as hell don't need him for that, because ain't a damn thing he could ever teach me about how to love my kids. This one really hit, gets me. I can't imagine not being part of my son's life. How come he don't want me, man? Wow, that's deep, man. Yeah, that was... Whew, yeah, I've actually lived that. Growing up, my mother, she, when she got a divorce from my father, you know, he basically did the same thing. One morning when my real dad came to the house to say, hey, I want to come and hang out with my kids, and my dad, my stepfather, he came forward and he said, you left your kids. And I took this, I took this man on and these are my children. I've seen that so many times and it's still, I just had a kid yesterday write to me and tell me he looks at me as his second dad, one of my students, because his real dad bailed. I'm not only a father to my kids, my own children, like, that's why I refer to my students as my kids. Like, I see them as my kids. You're an amazing teacher for doing that and, like, being an inspiration like that. 
the worst part is I feel like I could do more. That's definitely a five. Big time five right there. Probably a four. It's a five. Five. I would say four. Three. Another five. It made me connect when I saw it when I was young, connect to my dad that he was there. So we actually have one last video for you and you're not gonna have to rate it. And this one we're only showing to you. Oh boy. <sighs> hey Papa, happy Father's Day. Hopefully you're super surprised at this video. You've made it very difficult to find anyone to even come close to the kind of man that you are in my life. I love you very much. You're my hero. You always will be. And I hope you have a great Father's Day. I love you. That was a little bit tough. I'm up there in age, so I'm not necessarily counting the days, but I mean, life happens. Uh, so you just try to make as good impression and leave lasting memories with the kids, your grandkids, everybody that you're involved with. Happy Father's Day, Daddy. You're the best dad ever. <laughs> Happy Father's Day, Daddy. We all love you. <laughs> you're the best dad ever. <laughs> Hey dad, happy Father's Day. I hope you have the best day. You are the best dad. You do everything for us and I That's my 20 year old right there. I need you right there. Yeah, she thinks she she thinks she all that. Hey dad, happy Father's Day. She the one she the one graduating. And I hope you're having a great day. Oh man, that's awesome right there. And that's let you know to have how much they appreciate you, you know, what you did for them, you know, what you're doing for them still. Hi dad, it's your favorite and only daughter, Anna, and I am here to wish you a happy Father's Day. I don't tell you enough how much of a truly great father you are. You are so kind, caring, and compassionate, and I've always looked up to you as a role model. You know how much I love you. Wow, I didn't even know. I didn't know she did that. Beyond words, that was tremendous. Happy Father's Day, Dad, and I've made a video for you. First of all, I'd like to thank you for giving me life in the first place and always being there. I'd also like to um, thank you for being the more comedic side of the family or else it'd be probably really boring. Whenever I get mad, I, I, st I still do love you. This and um, this video is kind of to thank you for all that you've done to raise me in make me into a better person. But remember to vote for Pedro. <laughs> All the gifts he's given me throughout the years for Father's Day, like he little paintings I keep in a drawer. So this is something that's definitely very special. Hey God, I'm eating dinner right now and I just wanted to say um, thank you for everything you do for us. And thank you for supporting me and whatever I want to do and for supporting Noah and whatever he wants to do. You're really good dad and I'm happy Father's Day. Aww. Hey dad, um, I just want to say that I love you and that you're the best dad ever and thank you for supporting me for everything I did and that I wouldn't replace you for, for anybody else and that yeah, I, I love you. Yeah, but you don't cry, you know what I'm saying? Don't be tearing up, because I already know how you are. Not nah, kidding. But yeah, have a good Father's Day. Oh, that's nice, man. The babies, uh, thank you. What's up, Dad? Oh. It's your favorite kid here, Will. <laughs> My favorite kid. At least I hope I am. <laughs> but I just want to say happy Father's Day to you. You've been such a huge impact in my life, from being a great role model, from sacrifices, and just, just unconditional love that you put in between me and the family as well. You've always been the backbone and I appreciate you so, so much. You've, you are literally like a real life hero. I never really say it, but I just wanna say I love you so much. I really do truly appreciate you. You like are a hero to me. Love you, Dad. Love you, son. Peace. All right. Okay, you got me. All right. You got me. It's a beautiful thing when he said that, uh. I'm his hero. You make a lot of sacrifices and you give up a lot so that they can, you know, have the fun that they want to do and live their dreams. Happy Father's Day, Daddy. Thank you for helping me with my math homework and playing basketball with me. Thank you for being encouraging with my writing. Jake? Thank you for playing 
Thank you for playing with me, he says. You love you. Love you, love you. They're everything to me. They really are. Being a dad is one of the most awesome yet terrifying things ever. Thank you for that, that's so cool. I just wanted to say how much we love and appreciate you. Like all the things you do with us, like me with baseball and keeping me in check and with school. And I just want to thank you and tell you how much I love you and appreciate you for everything that you've done for me throughout my entire life and always just being that dad figure. And I just want to say thank you and I love you. We, we hope, hope you have, have a happy, happy Father's, Father's Day, Day and we, we love, love you so much. much. Okay, okay, bye. bye. <laughs> I've been lucky to be a part of Mandy, my, um, my wife's daughter's life for most of her life. Um, her father is huge in her life. I know that they share uh, an amazing bond and I'm very proud to just have a small piece of that. And for my kids, I know that they know I love them and I know that they love me. That was a one. <laughs> it didn't make me feel anything. <laughs> Thanks for watching Dad's React. We'll be in tears if you don't subscribe and hit the bell. See you later. Happy Father's Day to all them great fathers out there. Hey everyone, Lauren Producer here at FBE. Thank you so much for watching this special Father's Edition of Try Not To Cry. And all of us here at FBE want to wish all the dads out there a happy Father's Day. Bye everyone.